Akuma MC Season 4 just released last Saturday. Some other YouTubers and I are doing a versus series, and I'm going to quickly just explain the rules for you, and we'll get right into the video. We're not allowed to trade, use Auction House, and a bunch of other commands. We get one hour a day to play, $10 buy craft every single day, and 10 times the progression. At the end of the series, whoever has the most progression gets $1,000 buy craft. Stay till the end of this video to see the crazy amount of progress we can make at in one hour at 10 times the progression. I know there was a not or a, what a lot of awesome things uh, added this season, which is super awesome. Which I want to get into a lot of that content. I'm just gonna kind of plan a little bit as we go along. Uh, ooh, first of all, new mine, which looks absolutely beautiful. They added this new mortar, which looks. Insane, I have no idea what I'm doing with this, but I'll figure that out in the future. So we do have infinity rank, which is a huge thing for us this season, because I didn't have that. That's two whole ranks that I just got for this series. I'm gonna go ahead and start by using all of these, because we want to get a significant boost in terms of tokens and all that. We do get two robot generators, which is awesome. Hello, good sirs. I would very much like to add this to you, and this to you. We also have a pet egg, which gave us a prestige pet. Well, I have two, but I can't activate them both at the same time. Also, there will be a full list of all the other competitors in this in the description. Go check them out, show them some love, and uh, <coughs> check out their series and let me know their secrets. Uh, <clears throat> I want to start off by maxing out this. I want to go ahead and get that, of course. I want to go ahead and get... Keybinder could be good. Let's get Jackhammer. I, I, I think Jackhammer is probably going to be the best way to start this off. Because Jackhammer is just massive. It is insanely good. I think this is the first time they've ever done a Versus series here, which is pretty freaking cool. I'm excited to be a part of it. And if you guys are excited to watch it, again, uh, leave a like. I shouldn't even say this. Leave a like on the video. Make sure you watch all the way through to see all the awesome progress we can make in an hour here. Oh, what's this? Skin box? Wait, what? Requirements mine rank 170, pickaxe level 68. So I can't even use this? Aw, oh, dude, that's uncool. Oh, I have 20 trillion. Hey, let's, uh, let's max this out. Uh, W. Uh, and then let me get a level, uh, let's get 10 levels into that, why not? Just think, when, once we actually can use all of our 10 times boosters, this is gonna be insane. I really wish I hadn't messed up and actually used my, uh, my token one instead of the crystal one. But it's fine how it is, we'll get through it. There is still a skin tab. So there's the <laughs> Shadows clone skin. Hell yeah! That's awesome! I believe that they have a rarity system in check now. I don't know exactly know how it works. The only skin box thing that we have is unfortunately too high for us. Actually, not not by much, right? Is it, it, I think it's 175 or 170 on the mine. And we're all in 10 more levels on our pickaxe. If I had this, I'd, I'd already be there. I guarantee it. I wonder who's going to win the competition. I, I know I should be like, yeah, it's going to be me. But I don't think so. I feel like if anyone, it's going to be Jen, potentially. Or someone like not Connor. I don't know the other people too well, but they, both of them seem like, I mean, they're hard grinders. I know Jen's been around the server for a long time. Uh, Connor just seems like a smart guy, and he probably knows what to do. Hey, who's your favorite YouTuber? Who's your favorite Minecraft YouTuber? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm kind of curious. Oh boy, rank 135. We're actually making some insane progress in the first literally 35 minutes. I really wish I hadn't gotten two freaking uh, of these guys. It's actually super annoying. <laughs> Not gonna lie to you, but it is what it is. Just a little bit to go and we shall be done with all of the- We're with uh, 75 on our pickaxe. And then I just need like 50, no, 75 more levels and I can use the mortar. I just want to use the mortar, man. Come on. How do you add something as cool as the as the mortar and lock it behind pickaxe level 150? I just want to mortar the mine. I can actually go ahead and pump a few frozen gorge is activated. A few more levels of frozen gorge. Alright, it is day number two here of Akuma MC and R versus series and I've got some catching up to do. When I did my first hour yesterday, I unfortunately didn't have the 10 times booster. Now, right now, I also currently have some boosters going, which means I also won't have a 10 times booster, except for a 10 times gem booster, which I will be utilizing. I did also get a nice little package off of the store, which gave me three ultimate contramen, two pet eggs, one hero pet egg, a V kit companion shard, and this beautiful start of the world crate. I'm gonna go ahead and start off by opening these ultimate contraband crates. We didn't get anything too crazy from that, if we're being real, but I do have these pet eggs I wanna use. 
We got a prestige rare pet. Ooh, that's definitely worth keeping, and a crystal pet. I'm also gonna activate this hero pet egg, which will give us a rare Poseidon pet. I'm just leaning into crystals right now. I've got uh, two things for crystals, plus the 10 times crystal booster still going on from last time. We're gonna go ahead and also use this and then the start of the world crate. Please, if I can unlock this, that would be huge. One time use. Shocker. I'll go ahead and use. Oh, that's. Well, we're opening it, I guess. I was going to save it for la later, but sure, I guess we're opening it now. And I get six times pet eggs. That is such a scam. So we got a hero pet egg. Let's go and use that. We got a bomber pet. That's pretty freaking awesome. I'm actually going to swap to him uh, to start. I think it's time to start mining after I remember to put this up. Um, I could mess with some of this later. I'm not too worried about it right now. I originally was gonna just wait half an hour, but like I said, I don't think the boosters actually go away when you're offline, which is kind of annoying. Um, but I also get it. It's also good. I wish we could clear boosters. That would be cool. Um, because I'd like to just clear the ones that I have and just, or, or just override them with better ones. That would be cool. But I realize this is a good, uh, little showcase, because obviously at the start of this already you've already seen the the slow progression that normal players get which it's not bad um because it is meant to be you know you play multiple hours a day potentially throughout the week um and you've seen if, or if you haven't seen my series you can see the amount of progression you can make just playing two hours out of the week but now with 10 times progression once these boosters run out in like half an hour uh i will finish off this well, our segment here by showing you the progression you can make with 10 times the progression in it won't even be an hour, it'll be half an hour. I don't know what my main goal is right now in terms of enchants. Like, uh, you've probably noticed I've been like confused on it. I'm like, ah, oh, do I get this? Do I get this? Do I get that? Do I get this? I don't really know. It's been a while since I've just recorded a video. I normally. Well, that's not right. <gasps> I, I haven't recorded, like, recorded a video in a fat minute. It's usually always on stream, so it's very awkward to be doing this in just video format. I didn't get to open this last time. What do we get? So this is the new way it works. It's a level 16 or 17 box. I get one, one? Actually, before I continue to mine, I want to go ahead and get 14 levels into this. I want to go ahead and get uh, one level into that. And I want to go ahead and get... Ooh, what do I, I mean, yeah? Yeah, we'll go gems. Oh, we had a, a, a block reward. I forgot every certain amount of blocks you break, you get a reward. In this case, it was 10 trillion tokens. That is super awesome. Oh, we got another skin box. Level 11, we can open it. Please give me something good. A shadow clone one. It's only one, but that's still awesome. I'm also just kind of watching my gems fly up on the side as well, and it is... It is beautiful, especially when, like, Blessed or uh, Gem Finder proc. It is, I mean, just beautiful. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. So, number one, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get... I'll get this to, like, 500-ish. That's good enough. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and level this up. Ten levels. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, it's time. Okay. We can actually activate our token booster and one of our pickaxe XP boosters. Bam and bam. Now we should be getting ten times the progression in both of those. Pickaxe level 98. Massive. And rank 238. Normally by episode, I think in episode one, I normally try to hit 250 or at least in episode two, I hit 250. I just can't stop ranking up. Please, God. I mean, that's actually a good thing. I feel like a lot of this is just going to be me just cutting in and out of upgrading things, which is kind of hilarious to me. I mean, that's normally what it is, but it's a lot quicker. It's like I go silent for a bit, think of what to say or whatever, and then I look at my currency and I'm like, oh, I'm rich. I should probably do something about that. And 125, and I have 100 and, and a nuke. I have 125 trillion. That is enough to max that out, and then I've got 100 trillion left. I could level up some enchants or i could level up my robots which i think i'm gonna do that over anything else i could also level up this guy i'm gonna not do that i'm gonna go and warp to robots i'm gonna level up some of these guys i have three thousand crystals so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go uh slash pets i'm gonna start by upgrading this one to max if i can that is i cannot so i'll go ahead and just spend all my tokens on that and a little bit into this it this upgrades for less the reward but it's still worth it that is it for episode one for me of akuma mc's uh season four versus series I, I don't really know what to call it this is going to be an insane season and i hope you guys stick around for the end of this entire season watch the whole series it is going to be absolutely insane it's going to be content heaven 
and check out the other guys down in the description below. Go check out their series, see their perspective, see their perspectives, see how they're progressing. Leave a like if you enjoyed this one. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one.